Morning Nation. All right, so it's welcome to another wonderful show we have today in How Not to Suck at Teaching. Uh, I'm your host, Mr. G, for most of you. All right, so today we're going to talk about beverages. All right, so today's topic, we're going to be talking about beverages, things that you need while you're teaching. Uh, for me, coffee is one of the most important things in the world. Um, you have to have coffee if you're going to get through a school day, you're going to have to have coffee if you're going to try and teach any class whatsoever. Uh, but the other most important thing to have is a water bottle. Now, why am I bringing up beverages? Well, here's the thing. When you're talking a lot fast to a class, to a group of people, you get dry mouth. So, coffee. So make sure that you have a beverage with you as you're engaging with your students. Plus, it help, it gives your hands something to do. Since you're not sitting there like some crazy psycho, like, hey, you have to learn this today. If you're going to learn anything at all, you need to learn this. This gives you something to hold in your hands so that your hands don't go psycho. Um, plus, it's just an extra point to have just to, so that you stay hydrated all the time. It's, as you were up teaching, you're moving about it. Hydration is one of those important things to, to consider that most people do forget as you are teaching. Um, Downside is restroom breaks, uh, which are usually hard to come by for most teachers. Try and go, you know, in between classes, uh, planning if you can wait that long. Uh, usually try and, you know, finagle yourself the way possible, work with a co teacher, however you need to do it. Um, but notice about my beverages here I have a coffee cup that's got a uh, press lid, which so that none of the coffee gets on my edit that part out now we want to turn it upside down crap the reason that you need to take care of that is because crap. Right. now one of the most important things about having a beverage in the classroom is is that it is a sealed container you don't want an open lidded container because you know some children are um, evil uh, and they could put something in your drink. So I me, mean, I always make sure that all my beverages are closed, sealed, lid. Uh, if they have a straw, something to where it's a closed container, it's just a safety thing. Um, you don't want to always be on the fence of like, oh, I don't trust any of my students, but you never trust your students, ever. Uh, so make sure that you put that into place so that when you are uh, teaching your class, you have a beverage with you, make sure there's a lidded beverage at that so that you don't suck at your job. All right. So, as always guys, I'm Mr. G. See you guys next class. Hey class, I hope that you liked that last video. Please don't forget to like and subscribe down there at the bottom now. I'm gonna get back to uh, doing my thing, which is uh, work on my own stuff. So uh, don't forget to follow me on the web. I got a bunch of places you can find me, such as Pinterest, or no, not, not, we're not doing Tumblr. Uh, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, uh, group me, that's a new one for me, and Steam, uh, and my personal favorite, YouTube. Check me out, like and subscribe, see you guys later, next class. Follow, see you later, next class, do your homework. <laughs>